back to another unboxing video. What's in here? Well, it's something that I've had my eye on for a bit, but I didn't know whether it would suit me. And I still don't know until, <laughs> until we open it and check it out. But it's a new hat. But, like I say, not the world's best with hats. I wear this one, trusty Bob hat. It's been with me, poof, gosh, numerous winter camps. It's a great wool hat, nice and warm. Keeps me head nice and warm through the night. So yeah, do I suit it? Yeah, I think I do. I wear this one. Not often, but I do wear it. <laughs> Same again, if I forget that Bob hat, I put this one on and I kind of wrap it around my head like that. And that keeps it toasty warm. This one I wore, flipping out what were it, when me and Charlie did um, Angle Tan. And that got me down from that really cold wind in the morning that we had. But yeah, wore this, kept my head nice and warm. So yeah, um, I wore this. Caps. I don't think caps super. And they hurt my head as well. Kind of round here, it hurts. After a bit, it kind of hurts, no matter what. What setting I've got it on <laughs> the back of my head, but it, it just tends to like bug me. So I don't often wear this to be honest with you. Do I wear this one? Really? Do I wear this one? I probably do actually. Not much, but I do wear it. Look at that. Oh, also I've her again. Lovely long locks, green, long green locks. <laughs> Picture right here what I used to look like. Never worn this in my life. Never worn it. It's not even mine, it's Charlie's art. <laughs> what do you reckon? Start a new trend off in woods. Bright yellow. What can I say? Stealth. Stealth all the way. <laughs> right, that's it. We've gone through my app collection. This is my new app. This is what we've all come to have actually have a look at. Me as well. So this is the Tilly Wanderer hat. Now, whoa, I've just been out with Jason and uh, he's got one. And I really, really liked it. Not tried it on. So I thought I'd like one of them. So being that it's coming up to my birthday this month, uh, my mum and dad have, have bought it me. They're not cheap, £51 uh, with £3.99 I think postage and packing as well. But that's it, that's the Tilly Wanderer. So it's basically like a, a washed look. So it looks as though it's been worn, which is what I wanted. I don't like things that look pristinely, you know, especially when with what we do and what we get up to so here goes let's give it a try now bear in mind that you would think would be the front the little emblem there but it's not that's the that's the back so let's try it on and see if i got got it right i can't actually see without my glasses so let's grab my glasses and have a look this is the first time like I said I've actually tried it oh that ain't bad is it a little bit indie a little bit indiana isn't it huh we'll raid some tombs with it that looks pretty cool so what I've got it for basically um through this like hot spell that we've just had it's been absolutely ridiculous on my head um, oh God. so I wanted something with a brim and uh, being that Jason got it for his birthday and I really liked it I thought that'll, that'll suit down to the ground that'll be perfect for what we get up to bushcrafting and, and hiking and wild camping and stuff like that so I thought that'll do it but it's perfect for winter as well you know, if it's raining, it's it's not entirely waterproof, but it'll keep your uh, 
it'll keep your head from uh, from getting soaked. So I believe you can prove it. So we'll have a look into that. But yeah, so this is the Tiller Wanderer. So what has it got with it? So it's got a nice wide rim, and there's the sticker, which reveals, believe it or not, a secret compartment that you might not know, but now you do. So now you know where I keep, I will be keeping the money. So yeah, that's a nice little secret compartment in there. If you can put your money in or your, uh, your little first aid kit, whatever you want to put in it really. Uh, yeah, two straps. They obviously need sorting out. They're a little bit too tight around my chin because I've got a big head. Uh, front and back. So just in case uh, the wind is hitting you from the rear. That's going to catch hold and stop it from coming off over the uh, over the front of your, your head. So yeah, made in Canada and uh, been going for years Tilly, haven't they? Heritage collection, lovely. So as you can see it's a uh, it's wash lock. So it's got two two press studs, one on either side. This is a size seven and a half. Um, well, I'm saying size seven and a half. It's it's a little bit weird. So what you have to do is go on the Tilly website, and um, there's a measurement it tells you how to measure it. So basically, you get a get a piece of paracord. That's what I did. Wrap it around your head, and then just make sure that you've got a slight gap just in between the. And then get yourself a tape measure, put it down on the uh, on a table, measure it out, and mine come to what was mine? Oh gosh, I think it was sixty. Is it sixty centimeters, something like that? And it works out at seven and uh, seven and what is this? Is it seven point five or is it seven point? It's somewhat weird anyway. I'll put it up on the screen in the description below my head size anyway. But that's how you measure it. So you go onto your Tilly uh, website and then drop down boxes and have a look at your measurements on there. But yeah, I'm pretty impressed with that, and that is that is that is a damn good good fit. Let's try it again. So what you're meant to do is be able to get two fingers up there, which is what I can do. And that's fine. That's not going to blow off. Also, you tip your head forward and it doesn't fall off. You've got the right size as well. <laughs> but that is that seems perfect. I'm quite I'm quite impressed with that. Yeah, cool. So yeah, this is going to be coming out with me a lot. So at least you won't have to see me bald, shiny head anymore. <laughs> All right, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it. If it's of interest to you, you think about uh, giving us a thumbs up on this one, that'd be much appreciated. And also, if you uh, if you fancy having a look at uh, some of my other videos, got plenty down below down there. And uh, why not hit that subscribe button? And uh, and yeah, yeah, as soon as I get another video up, it'll pop up in your feed. All right, thanks a lot. Take it easy, guys. Bye.